The 2011 CRC Speed Show was held at the ASB Showgrounds in Auckland on the 23rd and 24th of July. The show was a great success with a positive turnout of punters taking in the sights and sounds, all centred around the theme of horsepower on wheels. A large percentage of those attending were motorcyclists, and we took the opportunity to speak with some of the exhibitors. First, we'll speak to Shane King of Crown Kiwi on the Alpine Stars stand. We're here with former World 500cc motocross champion Shane King with this stunning Alpine Stars display. Can you run through how the show's been going for you so far? Yeah, the show's been good actually. We've, uh, we've got a, a Geico Honda, which is a Justin Barshia replica of this year. We've got a, a, one of the KTM Red Bull um, 350s from um, Luke Burkhart. Um, a lot of Formula One suits from, um, from uh, Vettel, from Schumacher and Sutil. Uh, ben Spees and um, Casey Stoner's original suits uh, from Alpine Stars, but uh, just blowing me away with the amount of people that have uh, that have attended so far. You know, we're only halfway through the show, and and uh, we've just had a fantastic, a fantastic day so far. So we're looking forward to another fantastic day tomorrow. And a lot of people out there are surprised that that they can get absolutely anything, the top shelf stuff here in New Zealand. Yeah, I think we've really opened people's eyes up that have come onto our stand. You know, from from our BNS SB neck brace right through to our you know our stellar woman's boot you know they they've actually got a chance to to see the whole range that alpine stars does here in new zealand and um you know adventure gear this year is phenomenal with the new derb and jacket and pants and uh you know we're fortunate enough to have the 30th uh, edition of the ktm 990 on our stand the uh, with the lc8 engine so um it's just you know really really good to see the the positive stuff from people um enthusiasm in motorcycle right now you know especially for us at alpine stars being um you know one of the leading motorsport brands in the world um, you know, it's just great to see the people that uh, have come on the stand are very interested in understanding our brand, which is fantastic. Liat neck braces were at the show with Sloan Frost, who was there to promote the new road brace. Sloan's not only one of the fastest superbike riders we've got, but he's also one of the first people that I've seen racing with these new Liat braces. So Chopper, run us through what it is and why you wear it. Well, uh, we're, just, we're just testing it at the moment, and um, you know anything that uh, can promote safety has got to be good. I mean, I've grown up racing motocross and we've always used the Liat brace in, in motocross, so uh, being able to use it on a superbike is, you know, is, is going to be a real advantage, I think, you know, and, and anything can save neck injuries and, uh, you know, yeah. that's, that's the scary part of racing, unfortunately. But, um, so, yeah, we're, ju we're just testing it at the moment and uh, this is the new road brace. It's been uh, designed so you can wear it on your suit, so it's not quite like the, uh, the moto brace. So, so that's for the, the aero hump fits through there? Yeah, so just fits over the side of the aero hump. And uh, also, it's just it's designed because obviously you're so crouched down on the on the superbike that you can get your head back a little bit further than you than you could on the motocross brace. And uh, I actually had used the motocross brace on the bikes before, and it was a little bit more uh, more restrictive. So uh, so this one's really good. And on, on the road, the, the road riders, these could be the difference between uh, walking away from a crash and, and wheeling away. Yes, oh, absolutely. You know, on, on a road bike. Having something like this, it's not going to be as restrictive on a road bike because you, you're not quite laying all the way down, and um, you know just just bringing yourself just up that little weeny bit, you don't even notice that it's on. It's really light, um, and and it, when you do get it on over the leathers, as you can see on the uh, on the mannequin there, you, you don't even really notice it's on. So uh, anything that you can add add for safety, 